Today is the 6th of April 2014. This is a female 6 years old dog that came in yesterday with abdominal distension and straining and blood in the urine. So I uh, palpate the abdomen. Now, uh, abdomen palpate, the bladder has been uh, catheterized, so there is no full bladder. Now I'm palpating the abdomen for abdominal pain. See whether there is any abdominal pain. Anterior part, slightly painful. Better area. I can feel some bloated stomach. But uh, there's some pain here, yeah. There seems to be some pain in the liver area. The dog doesn't feel comfortable with the palpation. Now X-ray, X-ray has been done and it shows that there is no uh, letter stone or kidney stone. We just collect the urine by catheterization of the full bladder. So, so this is the color. Probably there's some blood there. We will, we will do the urine analysis. And uh, now, to practice evidence-based medicine, we should take blood tests. Because the blood test in this uh, dog with a high fever may show that there's a liver disease or kidney disease. But uh, at the moment, blood test has not been done yet. So. Basically, we, we only can eliminate that uh, there is no bladder or kidney stones uh, as far as the x-ray is concerned. And uh, so we will, we will uh, do the blood test and then uh, we come to a conclusion. That's what, that, that's what uh, evidence-based medicine is about. Unless the owner does not agree to the test. Otherwise, you miss one, like blood test, you might have missed a lot of uh, diagnosis because urine test and x-ray are two, two aspects of, of uh, evidence-based medicine but there's one more missing and that is the blood test so we will take the blood test afterwards okay finish